Why did H&A cut the steak? Did it just have uh, too many other financial obligations? It seems like that's uh, hey man, it seems that's uh, exactly what happened. Um, as we know, H and A has been in deep trouble uh, for a while now. Um, they said previously they want to stay a significant investor in Deutsche Bank, but in the filing that we saw, they also say they had to sell shares to repay a margin loan they took out with UBS and ICBC Standard Bank. So um, it seems that. If they weren't in a liquidity squeeze, there probably would have been other ways to repay that loan. So it does seem that seems to be at the um, root of all of this. What, what uh, are they going to be able to sell next, or do they still have to? Can they hold the rest of their uh, Deutsche Bank's um, uh, stake? I mean, they were very clear today that in a, in a statement, an email statement, they said they uh, don't intend to cut their stake in Deutsche Bank any further. Um, it's a very clear statement. Shares of Deutsche Bank are up more than the market, um, presumably because investors are reassured that H&A won't continue to cut. But of course, I mean, who knows what's going to happen to H&A. As I said, they're in trouble. We've seen the news. Um, each piece of news coming out on h and seems to be worse than the one before. So, yes, the plan for them is to keep uh, the level, the holding at the current level. Let's see if they can do it.